Hey Libra. So the energy's been pretty litty. I've been out and about in the matrix a lot today, a lot yesterday. So I've been feeling the energies, having my little antenna. Um, <laughs> I want to do who is hating on you and why, or what are they lying about? Okay, let's do like an extension from the reading of yesterday where I said, first they're hating on you and now they're lying. Cardi B song. So anyways, Eight of Cups, Libra, you have some people hating on you, lying on you because you walked away from them. Simple as that. In the bottom of the tarot, some people have a crush on you or they have some type of love feelings, lust feelings for you. They're hating on you because you may be not paying them any attention. You don't owe anyone anything, Libra, let me remind you. And you have a lot of envy at the bottom of the energy oracle. A lot of envy. These people live in the shadows. You see how she's in the shadows? Not wanting to come step out into the golden light energy. She also has her arm raised. Seems to be holding something. I'm not sure what. Dark magic at play trying to affect you or something. It's not working. All right, let's start with the tarot. Who is hating on Libra and why? People, some people feel very left out of your energy. Five of Pentacles, Libra. Those same type of people could be the ones that feel like you owe them something you... Uh, they don't know this new and improved you. No longer the codependent people pleaser. If you did struggle with anything like that in the past. <sighs> Who's hating on you and why? Well, first card out. And it got quiet. The Queen of Wands. Her dark, deviant energy. And I'm not saying all Queen of Wands are dark or deviant or work with dark magic. Not at all. But for whatever reason, Libra, for us, this Queen of Wands that I pick up on, and I'm using this deck, she's holding three candlesticks to produce, you know, the fire around her, some type of light. But she works with the dark. This could be the person that is very envious of you, Libra. The Queen of Wands. This Queen of Wands could be engaging in some type of effigy, voodoo doll. No matter what she's doing and no matter where she's putting the pins into this doll or effigy, Libra, it's not working. Because look at the picture of this doll. It's unremarked. There's no marks. Unremarkable. So let's keep going. Who's hating on Libra and why? Wow. What is going on, Libra? How is this happening? <laughs> Queen of Cups? Out next? Do you know the odds of that? Queen after queen, one after another, fire and water. You have a feminine Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces hating on you very heavily with the magician at the bottom. I'm feeling like this Queen of Cups energy could know people could have um, connections in higher places. 
than this Queen of Wands. Since the Queen of Cups came out with the Magician at the bottom and the Queen of Wands only had the Four of Pentacles at the bottom. Tell me more, Spirit. Thank you. Who's hating on Libra and why? This is powerful. What is going on? Wow. Libra. Legions. The devil has tried to send people. Five of Wands clarifying the devil card of who's hating on you and why. So this could be a Capricorn if it is not the actual devil energy with his minions, flying monkeys, demons. I'm feeling the energy of demons and demonic and people that crave power in the wrong ways. Look at the large wand the devil energy is holding. And all these people have smaller fire wands, right? Because they're not quite as big, obviously, as this devil energy. But they work for them. These people are obsessed with power. Just like the devil. And you're not giving in to them, Libra. You refuse to be one of these people that the devil has chained up. Go you, Libra. Go us. Who's hitting on Libra and why? This is so interesting. Give this reading a big thumbs up, please. And stick around till the end. You never know what's going to come out. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Ooh, my ears are hanging now. Top card. Top two cards, I'm hearing. The sun and the two of pentacles. Woo! With the tower at the bottom. These people are hating on you because their worlds are falling apart and crumbling. You have a Leo who's hating on you with the sun card. And you could have either siblings or actual twin energies. Uh, I'm actually, even though this is pentacles, I just heard Gemini twins. So a Gemini or a Leo. Or some type of siblings. They could be your own siblings. Who's hating on Libra and why? You won't play their game. You see these two twins. It reminds me of that one movie. The Shining. And they're like, come play. Libra's like, eh, nah. I'm going to go this way. <laughs> I'm going to go down the other hall. You got you girls. Take care. Take care now. Bye-bye. <laughs> Yeah. You won't play their game, Libra. Who's hating on you and why? The Ten of Wands. With the hanged man at the bottom. Pisces energy. This person is also could be a traitor. Or they could think they're more enlightened than you, Libra. They think they've put in more work than you. Someone that's hating on you. Maybe you've reached a higher level than them. Faster than them. With the Ten of Wands and the Hanged Man, they feel like they know more than you. They are more enlightened than you, Libra. They have put in the burden. They feel they've been burned. Interesting. One more card. Who's hating on Libra and why? Let's move into the other decks. I have the true crime deck, gypsy cards, and energy cards. 
One more card. Who's hating on Libra and why, please? Interesting. A Queen of Swords with a King of Pentacles. This could be some type of partnership between an air sign feminine and an earth sign masculine. This could be a couple. And if it's not a couple, you have a fellow Gemini Libra Aquarius. Again, this person is in a library holding a book. And I'm just hearing like, ha ha ha, like, I see this person in my mind's eye with like their nose up in the air even though they're supposed to be having their nose in the book. You preoccupy people's minds. Look how she's looking at you, Libra, rather than the book. Now, why is that? It's because you are on these people's minds when their minds should be on elsewhere. Mm-hmm. Wow. This is powerful. I keep saying that because these are all freshly channeled messages, and I love it. This King of Pentacles is thinking he can win you over with his wealth, and you're not impressed, Libra. Creating your own wealth. Also, speaking of wealth, we have royalty at the bottom of the true crime deck. So you could have... People in such high places concerned about who you are and who you are becoming, Libra. What you know, the knowledge I'm hearing that you're accruing. Who is hating on Libra and why? Do protect... Um, your family along with yourself. We have the child card at the bottom. Some people are very evil. They could try to send the evil eye to your children. Do take protective precautions spiritually. If you're into spiritual practices, especially for your children, just like you do yourself. You know, for those that are parents. Wow, Libra. <laughs> Two cards just came out. Oh, no. I hope this isn't the case, but for some of you, you have a friend who is hating on you. They could be working. I'm hearing accomplice energy hand in hand with an enemy. Because of your fortune. And I'm not trying to provoke um, or instill any fear. These readings are for 18 and up always for entertainment purposes, not to replace any type of legal or medical advice. But I do believe these are special messages from spirit. And Libra, you've got this fortune coming. <clears throat> Watch your friends. What do they say about friends and enemies? Keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. I don't know how I've ever felt about that because I feel like I'm such a person where I've finally came to a mature place in my life in my mid thirties where it's like, I don't have to have people around. I know I can enjoy my own company. So if you are my friend, it, it must be true. It must be like mutually friendship beneficial. Um, we've got each other's backs. We've been through similar things. We know how to help, you know, each other out, whether it was just talking or being there for a friend. And um, I definitely don't hang out with anyone who I would believe to be an enemy. I've finally gotten past that point in my life where it's like, frenemies, no more. Knock on wood. So, you know. Facts, Libra. Waiting. Gosh, you have people just like waiting on your next move. What's Libra going to do next? So we can try to either throw a wrench in it. 
or copy you. They're waiting on your success to end. I saw the death card at the bottom. I didn't want to be too morbid with that. So the next channel message I got after I saw it was they're waiting on Libra's success to end. Who's hating on Libra and why? Messenger card. This could even be a some type of postman, a very nosy postal employee with a messenger card. Or someone that is sent to give you a very important message could know a little bit of what about this message entails for you, Libra, and they're jealous. Interesting. But the butterfly. Some of them are jealous and hate on you. For the simple fact that you have transformed and you're beautiful. You've always been beautiful, but you're exceptionally beautiful nowadays, Libra. Some of them are hating on you because you are a wife. And maybe it's happy wife, happy life in your home for those that are wives. And enjoy that role, you know? They're hating on you for that. Or this could be oh, another wife hating on you as well. Or a wife if you're not married. Maybe someone's husband or significant other or whatever. Maybe someone's wife or husband is attracted to you. And their wife is jealous. Don't be jelly. Unless something was ever to come of that. There's no reason for that, you know? You have the thought card. Gosh, you stay on people's mind. Ooh, someone is seriously considering gifting you with something. You see how the thought, the guy in the thought card's holding this paper, this parchment, and it's like, He's thinking of sending this out. He has a gift for you, Libra. Some other people could be aware of this. You also have a young woman, someone younger than you, hating on you. Again. Enjoy your youth. What? Why are you hating on someone older than you? Like, what the heck? You've got your youth. <laughs> do what you need to do so you will you can be content by the time you're my age or whoever age I'm speaking with. You know what I mean? <laughs> so funny. All right, Libra, let's see who's hating on you. And why? Can you tell me more? Anything else specific Libra needs to know? <laughs> A body double. Deep. Fake. You have someone, I've been getting this lately, that has been trying to become you. Like, look like you, act like you. Try to take over your life. It's so weird. Like, like evil doppelganger energy, Libra. What the heck? Wow. You have a secret society hating on you at 1919 on the clock. And my nose is twitching as I hold that card. And we just saw the angel number 1919. If you want to, drop angel number 1919 in the comments below. I would appreciate it. Just because my nose was twitching and I was holding the secret society card. Whoa. Wow. One more. Who's hating on Libra and why? And then let's get the energy oracle deck. Who's hating on Libra and why? False flag. Someone who's false. 
someone who stirs up drama. They're telling lies. I heard, tell me lies, tell me sweet little lies. All right, let's see what comes out. Energy Oracle. Can you tell me anything else? Who's hanging on Libra? Why? Because of how loved you are. Angel of love. So many of you are, are adored, especially by the angels. People are jealous of how well you express yourself. The throat chakra, the fifth chakra. Again, an angel card. Archangel Gabriel. It could be, ooh, it looks good with my ring, turquoise. Look at that throat chakra. They're jealous of how you communicate, Libra, how your voice. They could be jealous of your voice. Wow. <laughs> or how you're able, you could have the gift of gab. We are charmers, naturally, Libra. So maybe you have the gift of gab as well. People are hating on that. <laughs> your verbiage, how you use your words. Your little mind dictionary. Thesaurus. <laughs> Libra. They're jealous of how you follow your temple path. Some people are actually hating on you because you have a connection to the other side and they don't. They could if they put in the work, but they make they could make fun of you behind your back or hate on you because you have this connection and it's simply because they lack it. You also have a lot of romantic attraction, man holding a heart. People are hating on you because of that. One more card. Why are they hating on Libra? Wow. Hostilities. With magician in the mirror at the bottom. Keep the feng shui cleared in your home. Keep organizing every day. Just do a little bit of something. Keep cleaning. Keep your home organized and clean the best you can. Um, learn more about feng shui. Maybe you should cover your mirrors up at night. Um, definitely clean them often. Oh, Feng Shui and the placement of mirrors. Thank you, Spirit. It's not good to have mirrors facing your bed, to be honest. I mean, if you do, it's whatever. But, um, if you have like a stand-up mirror and it's facing your bed, I would suggest moving it to another section as well as you're not supposed to have mirrors in feng shui directly facing doors whether bedroom doors front doors back doors it's not good to have uh, mirrors facing directly facing the door so those were a little feng shui tips from your girl ash um there are some hostilities here libra they're getting hostile they could be getting desperate with their magic as well. Why are they hating on Libra and why? Yeah, it's because you made it, Libra. Or you're making it. You're going to make it. You, you're going to make it if you haven't already. Wow. People are generic copycats. They're fake. They need to find themselves. Eye roll, Decepticon. They could be trying to say you're the Decepticon, Libra, when really they are most definitely the Decepticon. And look what's at the bottom to double clarify. They're jealous. And there's that devil energy again, Libra. Look at the card. I know it's backwards, but it says devil energy. And what tarot card did you get out? Yep, the devil card. They're spiteful, they think bad thoughts, they're vindictive, and some of them refuse to release you. 
Again, you're rich. You made it. Bingo. On the money. Go have fun. Go have fun, Libra. Enjoy your life. Don't let anyone... Yeah, they have problems. It says he is toxic. Doctor appointment. Mental. Deceptive. Concentrate on your dream home. Your dream vacations. Your dream life. Or your dream car. Whatever the case. Focus on your dreams. And I'm going to leave it here. Libra. Love you from the bottom of my heart chakra. Give me a big thumbs up. I really enjoyed this reading. Stay balanced. Stay blessed, my friends. And protected at this time. Always. Peace.